Hey friends, welcome back to your girl Brittany and welcome back to part two of these SWAT reveals. If you missed out on part one, don't worry, I'll have that linked for you. So this is my Christmas in July swap that I hosted with my patrons over on my Patreon. And with this one, they had to pick and choose. They had various options in which they had to choose a loaded option, two options from the embellishment portion, a few, they had to choose one from a card portion and then they have to do an extra that they had to choose from so kicking off this video is denise and you can find her at denise abate smith here on youtube and also over on the gram this is how her very delightful happy um swap comes here in these really cute bags she has the little sweater here and then let me just double check oh and so she has um like the swap information for where the swap was and it says Merry Christmas in July. And then she also has a little um, trinket of um, trinkets <laughs> here hanging with like a little, like a candy pouch. She has a cute little silver acorn with a bow, very pretty ribbons here. She also used some of this wired um, like garland here as well as part of her um, packaging and then so we do have three she made one for me so let's go ahead and check and see <music> So here is Denise's swap and then I have the cute little sweater here as well with the same little information that's on the inside. She opted to do the loaded um, coffee cup which is one of the options. So adorable and she used the Phil and Frosty collection. So here she used a bunch of ephemera pieces and she also did some fussy cutting of the sentiments. We have hot cocoa, season's greetings, snowmen, cozy fries, happy Christmas and then she fussy cut out some of the little snowflakes here and she did do a double pocket. So in this front one I want to say is her cards and yeah, I do believe it's your cards. So we're gonna put that to the side. And so here's the first one here, really adorable. It says cold hands, warm heart. Um, and then we have the cute little snow globe here. And so we open this up and oh, these are goodies. Oh, okay, and never mind. <laughs> and we have a little wooden veneer piece of a snow guy, snowman, or it could be snow lady. I mean. A snow lady can have curves we don't know and then she also did a little mini mem decks of my svg that i created which you can find in my etsy shop which is always down below in the description box it is of the um, instant max camera it's a really really adorable i love that you use the colors to um, play within the theme of the collection you used and then in here she did a cute little envelope here it says hello on the back and we have a oh like a little mini um folio so is this okay so this is a pocket and she's included some of the cut aparts so yeah snow fun let's snuggle and she made a cute little tag adorable and then i like this little tuck spot here and then we have a little tag here and then um she um, does some design team stuff. I can't pronounce her name. I'm not even going to um, try, but make sure you go check out her Instagram. And um, it is an alley shop. So um, cute little stamps here. She did some coloring and added some stickles on there to make it shiny and cute. And then also a tag from the collection as well. And then as we open up the flap here, we have another cute little cut apart, keep warm and snuggle up. So really fun, I love that you did that. Super, super cool. I'm not sure if that was part of her um, extra goodies that she chose um, to include, but we also have, look at how freaking cute this pen is. Oh my gosh, I need more of these in my life. It says Merry Christmas and it gives me like some like, um, hey santa feels a little bit like um merry days oh this is so cute i love it gonna go with my little pen cup and then here um she has this cute little dog paper clip and here is her um information again a denise sabate smith on instagram and then the same thing with youtube and she has some little um ephemera pieces that she fussy cut out and some cut aparts as well 
using up that collection you go girl all about killing a collection so then in here we have a memory decks oh so sweet this was not um required but she uh i mean have fun like i mean go for it and so um again this is my um svg that i created of the instax mini camera and she put hello gorgeous on here put ho 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 on some little mittens and then she has the little snow person here and the little cupcake that says joy really cute and then she added stickles all the way around to help make a bling bling adorable and then here was that little um candy pouch of trinkets so we have some beads we have a little candy cabochon um we have some dangles hanging here of um she did some wire wrapping she has a little christmas tree and a little lollipop dangling here there's sequin and confetti on the inside really cute so that was all part of the front pocket so this next one here now these are the cards are these the cards? Okay. <laughs> I know that she has a cricket and she's been having one good time going on over here. So here are the cards. She has the little ephemera pieces from the collection. So she has the little log here. She has the bear and then she has the snowman. And then inside is her card and she did the shaped card portion uh, option. I mean, and really adorable. She had a little snowflake here. She uh, used the pen and had a Christmas tree made. It says, wishing you a Merry Christmas. And then added the little tree there. Super cute. Oh, adorable. Fits perfectly in this card. And then here we have a blue one. And, oops, I think I stuck. And then here we have the holly berries on that one. And then the last one she created, she did like a little burgundy with the lime green. And then here she has the little coffee cup wishing you a Merry Christmas. Really, really cute. So next we have her embellishments. And so she did some bows and I love this little mason jar zip bag. Definitely reusing that. And so look at how pretty that holographic little green paper is. Really super cute really really like that and then we have the green and then we have the pink here so really cute bows very universal you can use them for whichever collection that the colors apply to and then her other embellishments she did shakers and then she added the cozy on top of this bag And so the shaker she did, she has the little bow here. Really, really cute. I like that she added the pearls there. She used it vellum um, for her piece there. I love that. It's like, it's kind of like a peekaboo, you know? You can see me, but you can't, you know? And then she, this is the base portion. So the bow technically goes like this, but you can separate it and make it, you know, make it your own. And so she added the holly in the center there and has a little snowflake. And again, she added some pretty little gems here. And then here she used the marshmallow one and she used, um, what should I call it? A tool for this one. Really, really cute really love how you did that and then she has a cute little like their little rock gem really really pretty love the mix that she used there really really pretty and then for her goodie option she did store-bought and she's included the collagen infused facial mask ooh, by spa life and it's winter skin facial mask and it's rejuvenating get that right rejuvenating okay so really really cool thank you so so much for playing and participating denise always love it that you do make sure you guys go ahead and check her out and let's go ahead to the next one all right next up we have yancy you can find her at yancy creations over on the gram and this is how her swap come and it looks like she did embellishment books and i am so super excited look how fun these are these are so stinking cute she did leave a note saying that um she didn't have enough paper to do everything relatively in the same paper collection, but they are similar. So that is perfectly fine. That works for me. Um, 
I don't think anybody will be upset. So she did leave a list of what she did do um, for her pick and choose. So we already know she did the embellishment book for her embellishments that she chose to do were rosettes and bows. And she did the note cards. I'm guessing the regular note cards. And then she, we will go ahead and take a look at her special gift that she sent. Um, I do know that she sent me a message and said that this one was mine. So we have three. Let's take a look and so see. this is how enc swap comes absolutely stunning and gorgeous look how fun this is look she used that um leaf trim from hobby lobby she did some beautiful layering she has a snowball trim in the background to create a shaker she used a little felt ornament piece layered on with that um like that meshy type webbing and then she has a rosette she used um some ephemera and thicker pieces from whichever collection it is i can't uh, it looks familiar i can't put my name on it and then it says fa la 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 and then we have a little ginger oh look at so cute and then we have a pretty poinsettia here on the spine we have this cute little bow and the little candy canes on there and again that's where you can find her yancy creations because it's already sitting out i'm gonna go ahead and show you guys so her special gift was a dangle and look how cute this is i'm trying to find the top i think this might be the top here and look how absolutely cute this is i love it all the reds and greens the whites she has a cute little stocking here she has the gold and she has a cute little rudolph really really pretty absolutely love that and then um she has this sealed off okay so let's see here oh so you just take the little binder clip and that room opens it up cute so let's open her. So let's flip the page. So look at these cute little bows here that we have. Really, really adorable. I can't, I think that's a little wreath there. And then here we have a little Christmas tree. Use some texture paper on this one. And then some pretty glitter paper on the next one. Super cute. And then look at these bad boys. I man, y'all know I love me some chunky. And she did some chunky rosettes. Yes, girl. And so, um, different variations of oops different variations of them we have um we have a little elf here it says twinkling lights she has a little um lights banner here wonderful layering using up those ephemera pieces we have santa down here and it says ho 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 the little candy cane tree in the background hey that's coco and reno what's up y'all and we have um some bows there and then we have this big luscious one here oh my goodness gorgeous we have like look at all those ephemera pieces one thing i love about chunky i want to be able to see everything that you did all right there's one there's a there's a, a defined moment when it comes to chunky but if i can't tell what it is and if i can't see every element then it's a little too chunky um but we got canning cane she did a double layer rosette we have some snowflakes in the background she has stockings she has trees we have a cup of cocoa it says peace love joy we got a little mouse or it could be bear probably a bear bear makes more sense <laughs> popping up out of the stocking a little mitten here that is so cute and then down here we have the little christmas tree we have the little um they don't look very reindeer like or is it a moose it looks more moosey <laughs> it says love of family and she also used the gold thread on there so stinking cute and then here we have her other bows i love this one here oh my gosh i love it and then there's um i think this is full leather that she used and she did like a double layer i'm not sure it kind of feels like it but she has a cute little reindeer in the center and then this one here she has the glitter paper on top of the holographic one really pretty with the christmas tree center and then last but not least we have her note cards that she included and so she has a cute little polka dot there and then we open this up oh adorms she has a little ginger and it says tis the season with the green snowflake in the background candy canes all over and then she added a little light bulb jemmy piece on the inside so cute and then this one here we have the um red glitter snowflakes here the candy canes with the tree we got a stocking there and it says joy with the bow on top and then she has a little tree on the bottom
And last but not least, we have, oh, for cute, the little snowflakes. And then we have like an embossed star right here. Then we got Rudolph and it says Christmas. And then inside she has the little bulb. How stinking cute are these? So adorable. Fantastic job, Yancy. Guys, make sure you go ahead and check her out over on the gram at Yancy Creations. All right, friends, and wrapping up part two, we have Shamika. You can find her at MikaBoo32. Woo, woo, woo. And this is how her super adorable swap came. Look how fun and happy. I'm pretty sure that this is Doodlebug. And this this looks so adorable. I love it. Uh, she looks like she did a pocket. Again, here's her information here. So Instagram and YouTube, MikaBoo32. And she has a tag of all the information. And it says, tis the season to be married. This is so fun. We have three. One is for me. So let's go ahead and take it. So this is what Shamika's look like. And uh, she left me a note. And she said that she used Doodlebug's Christmas magic and night before Christmas. So, oh my gosh, I'm so excited to see. And she did also leave on the tag that her goodie was the Beat It Dangle. This is so cute. I love this. So this is like a bookmark. So you just like put it on your page and then like it dangles. I've never seen this before, but that makes me feel like that that's supposed to be like a bookmark. And this is so cute. The cute little beads. And then she has the Grinch bead in the center. How adorable is that? I love that. And then since this is already out, I want to say that this is one of her sets of embellishments. Look at here. Oh, how cute are these? What are they? Mark. Okay. So, um, these are like little hearts. So it looks like she did the basic shape here. She did the little, um, phrase at the end. So it reminds me of a, um, of a scarf. And then we have some red tool. We have the scallop heart with layered hearts on top. We have this one that says family, Christmas, cheerful and warm wishes. Use sequins to add an extra element on there. Very, very adorable. And then here, look at this super adorable pocket. I am so in love with this. She has this glittered up little ginger. She has this cute bow. We wish you a Merry Christmas and added this fun little um, like tinsel tool. And then in this first pocket, we have Christmas bucket list. Oh, this is so cute. Oh, I like the way this feels too. Bake cookies, visit Santa, play in the snow, trim the tree, drink hot cocoa, wrap presents, eat candy canes, and make memories. Yes, that will be perfect to put inside a planner. And then here she's also added, oh, she added um, some strike looking ribbon. Oh, that's so cute. And it's by Doodlebug. Oh, for fun. I love it. Y'all and your additional goodies. Y'all so giving. And then look here. So we have some cut apart pieces, not cut aparts, but um, like ephemera pieces. Make sure there's something else in there. So this one says Merry Christmas. There's a little mouse going to bed. Oh, poor cute. I love that. And then we have Santa going down the chimney with his bag of toys. And then we have this really fun holographic snowflake. And then here is her other set of embellishments. She did some cute, the cutest little bows. And she, she did like a shaker bow style and added beads in this center how cute is that and look at how fun this paper is oh my gosh i just love it she added the cute little ribbon piece up across the top and just added a star very simple but still makes a statement so guys we don't always have to go all out really cute and then we have this little um clothespin here with the star on it and then here is her cards these are just too cute so um this one says merry christmas she has a little flower on there and with that little trim then we open it up and add a little christmas present on the inside and then this one here says peace love joy with the little light bulbs with the little holly and berry in there and then this one here, we're cute. I love these. And it says holiday cheer with the poinsettia in the center. And then she has a little peppermint. These are so stinking adorable. Love it. And then she has the envelopes there. So stinking cute. Make sure there's nothing else in here. Oh, there is. Oh, I love these. You know what? Um, who is it? 
Wandi gifted me these and I, I had cleaned my room and I can't remember where I put them and it made me so super sad but now I at least have these and once I use these I bet you hers will reappear so I'm so excited to have these thank you so so much let me put this on my cart so I don't lose it again and then she also made one of those cute little tea pockets this is so cute you know and this is on my things to make list it's very easy and super simple but i have a thing about doing very easy and super simple things i have to be challenging and so she added the cute um the little spoon here and then this is by twinnings and it's peppermint cheer Ooh, i have never had this one I'm gonna have to give that one a try. And then, oh, this is a honey stick. Where do you guys get these? I've never seen this one. I have never seen this. So if you guys have seen it before, like let me know. I This is perfect because I honestly do not like doing jars of honey. It gets sticky and over and over every time you use it. And um, I don't like the other honey sticks. I don't really like those. But that seems like it's going to be good. I don't know. Maybe it's the packaging. I don't know. But let's take a closer look at her pocket. Look how cute this is. And I'm not sure if this is a SVG or if this is a die. But it's really cute. So we have three pockets in the front. And then we have this top pocket right here. But this is so stinking adorable. So, so cute. Thank you so, so much for playing, Mika. It means absolutely a lot to me to from all you ladies for playing into the swap so guys make sure you go ahead and check out shamika at mika boo 32 and then if you want to take a detour over on the gram you can check her out there as well as yancy over at yancy creations and don't stop there make sure you go say what's up to denise at denise abate smith thanks so much guys make sure you go give these girls a holler and make sure you give this video a thumbs up and i'll see you in the next one bye